Hey guys, Michael and Jeff here. Um, today I am just going to be showing you um, a few things that I've made over the past week. I'm only making this video because I've made a video in a week and you guys are telling me to make a video. Um, guys, whenever I don't make a video for a week, it's because my dad either has the camera or I don't have a whole lot to show you. This time it was both. So, um, don't tell me to make videos because I know when to make a video and when not to. Like, <clears throat> I was already planning on making a video and my dad just kept taking the camera for his job. So, you know, had no time. But now I got the camera and so yay. <laughs> um, okay. So here, this is just a random mock that I made for Star Wars. Um, I saw season three, the premiere. My god, that was good. I love that. I really like how, um, oh yeah, quick spoiler alert if you haven't seen it. Um, I really like how they show the background and what it was like for training for Fives, Cut Up, Echo, Heavy, all of them. So that was really cool. It's really sad how Cut Up and Droid Bait die, though. Anyways, um... As you can see here, I just have a bunch of battle droids um, just attacking these clones and they're sort of just uh, getting surrounded. Um, I tried to put in as much detail in it as I um, wanted to just to make it, look, make it look more like a battlefield. Um, it's only one gray base plate. It's not much, so... My voice may sound a little weird because it's morning and I just woke up. Um, so yeah. There's that. And now I've got this Halo mock that I wanted to show you. Um, this is just a random mock and I got a warthog over there. Um, there's something, it's not a real map in any Halo game, but I just made it up out of boredom. Um, as you can see here, it's got sand with dirt on, dirt everywhere. Um, I mean, it's not the best. Do bush here, sand back there, and I got a rock here. So, and then it connects into this little river boat. But um, I got a tree here. <clears throat> there. And then there's actually detail there. Um, I mean, I think it's pretty decently detailed. I mean, it's not the best, but it's okay. I like it. Um, then over here, I got more sand with dirt on it. No, it's not real dirt for anyone who's dumb enough to think that. Um, Let's see, that's really that, and then I got just some more detail over here, and I got that random thing. I don't even know what the heck that is. I just put it there for looks. Um, yeah. Um, what else, what else, what else? Oh, yeah. I got another Spartan from LEGO Minifigure Series 2 when I stopped the Target yesterday. Another Spartan, so and I changed the face just to make it look better. Having two of the same face is almost like clones. But that's good. Um moving on, I've made a white elite. As you can see here, he's got a needler. Um I have not decaled this yet. I have to order some uh, decals from Saber Scorpion if I ever get around to that. Oh, I'm not promising that though. And then, over here, I got my webcam, yay. Used to use this old piece of crap for videos. Yeah, this is actually a brand new webcam. The other one that I use for videos broke down. Um, but I'm happy I use this one now, because I don't get any more comments about it. So that's better. Um, not sure if I showed you this, but I found an aerial advisor for this guy. My Republic Trooper. So he's pretty cool. Um, sorry if you guys think I'm just ranting on and on and on, but I'm just really trying to scrape up whatever I have to show you. 
Yeah, I took the, um, the headpiece off of her because I'm making a shock tea. No, don't go into my battle. It's a phone I use to call Targets and Toys R Us when I look for figure action figures. Um, this shotgun, I'm actually going to make it into a Halo Reach um, grenade launcher. See there? And then I added some minor paint details that you guys wouldn't care about, but it doesn't matter to me, but I mean, not to you guys. But, um, my George, I made him... Here. Just go over here. I made him taller. And I redesigned his, um... Gatling gun, I think that's what they call it. Um, you can tell he's taller if you look at the side of him. So, that makes him better. Because, believe it or not, my Emil is taller than my George. When he's the biggest in the squad, so did not want that. Um... And there's one other thing that I'm working on that I wanted to show you guys. Um, do do do. Ah, uh, it's not working. One second, you guys. Oh, and you guys might hear some background noise because um, my mom just got in. Um, so I'm gonna do a quick camera cutoff. Sorry, guys. Um, but I'll show you this in detail in a second so one sec guys all right i'm back um now you see what the camera cut off it won't e we won't even be able to tell but um it's like you'll just cut right in so you won't even be able to tell so it's kind of weird but anyways um you can see here this is my work in progress slash prototype of commander colt from the recent season three premiere um Really all he is is just an EP3 clone helmet with a rangefinder glued onto him right now. Working out a way to put a fin on the back here, but it's not working, so I'm probably going to go with a different design. Um, and then here I'll try to pull up a picture of what I probably will make mine look like. Do do do. Where is it? Here it is. Loading. Okay. I'll probably make it look something like that. Um, I'm not going to tell you who that's by yet. Because I'm not sure if he wants me to keep it a secret or not. And he probably does, so I'm not going to tell you. Um, moving on. That's probably what mine will look like. Eventually, when I get a Dremel tool. Um, you can see he's got arm decals with JPO 1997 and legs. Um, just an EP3 torso right now. That, I will change. I'm actually gonna ask JPO 1997 for decals for this guy soon. Um. Okay. Whenever he gets back on. You can see here. I've got... Fail. My cat, from Noble Team, I changed her up a bit. Sorry about that background noise. Cause I, that's really loud, actually. <laughs> Um, you can see I got, I changed her arm to a chrome arm. That's only because her robotic arm is thinner than her normal arm that isn't cut off. <laughs> um, and the agent and minifig, mi bleh, the agent and minifigure's arm is actually, um, thicker than they, her normal arm, a normal Lego arm. So really, I just changed that and I put a chrome arm on there, make it look more like robotic at the same time and thinner um i'm not going to paint that arm because i may want to put it back on my silver stormtrooper um so yeah um made this battle damaged clone yeah he's beat up anyways Oh yeah, I'll just, I'll just show you what I've gotten with action figures, because I've been doing a lot of action figure stuff over the past week. Um, I've got my, I got a Halo Reach Ghost at Target yesterday. So that's really cool, and it's actually really big. Um, oh yeah, and I also made a white EVA. No. See there? White EVA with a custom gravity hammer that I designed. Um, 
going over here. Oh yeah, and guys, a um, Phase 1 Captain Fordo and Phase 1 Arc Trooper are coming up next in the next video. I will be making those soon or today, either one. Um, so yeah, and that is actually a promise because um, I already got the decals for that, so I will be finishing that. Starting it at least because I haven't started yet. Um, moving on. I'm on my squeaking bed right now. So, yay. Um, got some new Halo figures. You can see. I've got the white Mark V. Halo Reach Mark V-B. Um, got the red Mark V-B. From Target. That's a Target exclusive. Um, I got another Elite Miner. I've just got a bunch of the new Halo Reach figures, Marines, George, Emil, Noble Six, my favorite one. Um, Comic-Con exclusive Noble Seven, more Mark V-Bs and Hazops, and this is really dark, even when there's a really bright window right there. Um, no, Count Dooku fell over on the second shelf. Yay. He's actually a prototype figure, not yet released, got him off a... Um, Hong Kong eBay seller. Um, those two droids constantly fall over. Do do do. Let's see here. I'm really bored. Oh, see, I stand up one figure, the other falls over. That's aggravating. No. Okay, whatever. Um, that is really all I have to show you guys. And I do have an Xbox, but that I'm not gonna give you my gamer tag. Nothing against you guys, it's just I have so many people that want to be my friend and so many of you guys that are really helpful and support me, but how am I going to accept all of you when I can only accept 100 people? So, I mean, unless Xbox Live ever changes that, then I will add you. But until then, which that will never happen, I can't add you. Nothing against you guys. Um, so that's it. That's that. Um, so really that's it. I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.